We received a question about how to orient things in assemblies, and I wanted to go through and make a video about that. So first, when I go to insert a design, let's say I want to insert my lid right here, and I'll open that. Uh, I'll click and place two lids so that uh, I can show multiple ways that I do this. Uh, one way to orient things, because this lid has come in the wrong orientation, it needs to be flipped around, is I want to go to component placement and I can free drag with a triad the component that I want to place. Now if I click this angled edge you can see I get this angled triad that I can rotate it around but uh, maybe I don't like the placement of that triad. Instead I'll go to component placement and click on a different edge and you'll notice that my triad is oriented according to the edge that I select. So you can always uh, choose a different edge if you're not happy with your triad placement and I'll orient this all the way around here and close and then I can choose whatever mates that I would like or I can continue to uh, orient this in a different way but from here I think it's pretty clear that I can orient this lid on my hinge probably for spot welding or something similar and uh, we should be good to go but uh, maybe that takes too much time, right? Another way, and this is the way that I usually do things, is I just kind of look at what faces are going to be made to what when it is oriented correctly. So I know that when it's oriented correctly, I want this face resting on this hinge. And so I'll go ahead and constrain it, this face on this hinge. But you'll notice it's still oriented the wrong way. Yet I can choose this flip button here, and it flips it for me. And I can apply that. And then I know that I want this face to be coincident with this face when it's in the right spot. And so we can apply that. And from there, you can see that we've been able to just reorient it with the mates if we prefer to do it that way. And then my toolbox is getting close to being good to go. Oh, and I got to constrain my handle at some point too. So I'll work on that off screen. But uh, that is how we can orient our parts. Hopefully that is helpful. Thank you for watching and please subscribe to the Libre channel.